What's up guys, welcome back to the channel if you're new, welcome, welcome, doing some Feral Druid PvP Battleground Brawl uh, time lapse. I actually really enjoyed this one, so I'll probably have a couple of videos of it coming up. Uh, there's my talents, I normally run in BGs, gravity is fading in 15 seconds, so excited. Um, of course I do Fleshcraft and Bear Form to start, that gives me about a 10k, 10.5k bubble on top of my health so technically I have 50k health in cat form on this first fight going kitty form going prowl as soon as I get in the air uh, should land pretty close to MT which I do it looks like we have three here um, there should be a hunter here he left a trap maybe he's not here uh, should go bear form which I do to help cap the tower um, since we're not fighting anyone and we don't need to jump on anyone might as well just jump on it they got the flag first they have four or five in mid so I'm hoping that means we're going to get at least two to three towers pretty quick we get two here um, they're going DR um, yeah giving them a flag with no cap is not the best thing uh, gravity is about to go up so I'm gonna get a little closer to mid um, I'm gonna go ahead and prowl for the gravity to go off and we will see what happens um, if you haven't done this BG or a brawl um, the only person that doesn't get jumped up, I believe, is the flag carrier. Or if you're inside Blood or Blood F Tower or um, MT. If you're inside something where there's a roof you'll hit, um, that is why you will hit it. Looks like there's a battle at FR. Um, they captured the flag, so probably need to go mid and spin it as best I can. It looks like we got a healer here. Um, I'm going to jump on him just with rake. He's got his bubble up, so I'm just going to rake him real quick. Interrupt heal. Uh, healing Surge right there. Jump back on the Pally who bubbles. Since he's bubbling, I'm going to off heal. It looks like he's targeting the Shaman, so he's probably not going to be able to get too many uh, heals off. Uh, going to switch and go to uh, the Casters. Going to go Bear Form. It's a Rogue, a Boomy, and a Enhance, it looks like. And we a dog just came up and wants to play, so give it a second. I probably would have died there, but uh, time lapse, so there we go. Um, I did pop thorns in the air. I did pop frenzy regen. So should be back full health um, at FR. And it looks like we're doing good. Looks like MT needs some help. Uh, we still have two. If we get MT, we'll have three. Go ahead, pop. My dogs are like I think my dogs have the the time not time lapse. That's what the hell in this battleground. That would have made no sense. Uh, my dogs have the mental of a small child so it's like every five seconds they bounce around like that one wanted to play and then realize oh okay I'll go do something else and then it's like oh okay I'll play no nope, I'll go do so oh I'm hungry I'm going downstairs to eat it's just like back and forth back and forth back and forth jump it on the pally first of course uh, the healer was gonna try my bleeds are ticking so hard on that pally it might kill him in the air almost no I didn't kill him in the air I wish um, Go on DR in the air. Uh, there's a rogue with Berserker, so jump on him. Get a good rip on him. Uh, get silenced there by the Boomy, which is fine. Full bash the rogue. Um, he should die pretty quick here. Got to off heal and uh, make sure that rogue dies. Uh, jumping on the Boomy now. Um, get my bleeds up. Rip, rake, adaptive swarm. And uh, let's just let those things do the thing. Um, he's going to root. My bleeds are going to take pretty hard. I'm going to off heal here because they just had a bunch of res. Didn't know if they were coming here or not. Going to loot the insignias so they don't just run back to their body and come. Uh, first bite there of, I think it was 5200, 5300 for the kill. So pretty happy about that. Damage wise, I'm second right now, but I'm not doing too much other than flying from tower to tower. Uh, don't know which one I'm going to now. It looks like I'm going to go Blood Elf because that uh, shaman looked like he was coming here. So throw a uh, Moonfire on him. You can cast and hit, even melee hit in the air if you're close enough. So um, for instant heals like Reju, Swiftman, stuff like that, you can use it. And for a cast, Sunfire, Moonfire, and if you're in melee range, my dog's just about to eat the hell out of this toy. If you hear a squeaker, that's what it is. It's not me, I promise. Uh, I don't eat the squeakers. Mil milk bone maybe but uh, squeakers not so much um, we have three so if we have the flag definitely cap when you have three if you have three towers you get more points 
jumping on this healer. Don't know why he came in solo. Um, don't know why the mage poly do me that. was kind of weird. Took off all our uh, dots for no reason. And you just see the the bleeds tick 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 tick. Um, I'm just going in circles so I can be right back where I picked up. And there's a mage here now. Um, what else is here? Yep, that healer and that shaman are still here. It looks like they're running. Yeah, they're running. So I might jump on the healer. Yep. Jump on the healer. Break, rip, adapt to swarm. Uh, I'm trying to bash them. There's a bash, half bash. And uh, hopefully people can jump on if we can get a kill on the healer. That would be super nice, which we do. So that healer is going to have to rest somewhere. Um, we still have the three cap at towers, so going pretty smooth. Going to go ahead and flesh craft in bear form again. Um, going to dot that, uh, I could have stealth and jumped on him with a rake, but I wanted to get a dot on him real quick just in case. So I went ahead and threw a moonfire on that, uh, on that rogue just to make sure. Since I got a free casting regrowth, that's what that is in front of me. Uh, in the middle of my screen leaf, I can heal someone if I needed to. Um... It looks like, yeah, we have the numbers here, so this person's going to die pretty quick. Interrupt Wrath, and that's all she wrote. Um, I don't, I didn't even interrupt Wrath. Someone interrupted it before I could. But, uh, so we still have three towers, so we're getting more points. If we can get the flag, it's even a bigger, bigger lead. So we're doing pretty well. Um, yeah, so everything's going pretty well here. Got a lot of people running, so I was going to wait to get close to them to use Stampeding Roar. Uh right there that way i can get as many of them as i can in the stampeding world gonna jump on the rogue i just hate rogues man and uh rogues are stu stupor stupor rogues are stupor no rogues are pretty overpowered um they can basically one shot you in a stun i guess a feral could too so i can't really talk too much about being overpowered since i'm in the air i can throw a dot on that shaman i'm gonna go ahead and throw moonfire 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 uh, i'm gonna land i'm going to jump on him and uh, he's going to do that, which is a good move. And we're going to jump on him. Jump on it. Yeah. I tell you what, man. <laughs> Just people are dumb. I tell you. Uh, yes, Druid Healer is going to come in. So we're going to jump on the Druid Healer, of course, first. Uh, I don't know why the Hunter keeps trying to trap the people we're jumping on. And he takes all my bleeds off. It's just stupid. Um, we, we have two healers right here basically locked up. So it doesn't really matter. Um, just... DPS on both. We can kill them both. It's not gonna, it's not gonna hurt anything. Uh, jumping on the Ret who bubbles. Jumping back on the big ass tree, and we're gonna try to kill him. Adaptive form, burp, break, and feral frenzy dots on him. Um, in the air, yep, he died in the air. That whirlwind by the warrior, and my full bleeds on him was super nice. This is actually a cool fight on top of uh, MT. The shaman jumps down and dies. <laughs> Uh, I'm just going to heal this up, and uh, I'm going to take a little break, you know. I'm just going to sit here. We're capping the tower. Uh, I don't see anyone near here. They're all kind of running into the mid. So if we can cap the only tower they have, and they can't see me, so might as well just chill up here for a little bit. Enjoy. Look at the damage done. I guess I'm third right now. DPS is not high at all. Uh, I guess I haven't been in too many fights with multiple targets. And we have a warrior kicking ass. That's nice. And yeah, they just lost MT from the big ass bear sitting up top and the warrior sitting on the bottom. As you can see, I'm going to go super high. <laughs> because, yeah. I'm going to try to land back on the roof. We're capping MT, so let's see if we can cap it while I'm up here. And yeah, enjoy the view again. If you're still watching this. Losing my talents, just so you all have another idea of my talent. We're still capping MT, so I'm not going to fall down. Uh, there's my what I'm running, 207 item level, 20, uh, yeah, 25% crit. Yeah, all that fun stuff right there. Haste is crap, and Leech is 1%. That's just off the uh, cloak enchant, I believe. And yeah, so we're not capping it now, so that means to tell me they have two or three people in MT trying to get it back. Gravity's about to fade, so I'm sure I'm about to go fight. Can't sit up here forever, can you? Maybe you can. I don't know. It's a good game, though. Uh, we have the flag. We have three towers. They have zero. Um, don't know where I'm going, but hopefully I can get in a fight real quick. Since the game's almost over. Uh, don't see anybody. 
I'm gonna use uh, dash. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gonna jump on this guy. Gonna use dash. Gonna jump on this guy. We're gonna get. We're gonna get a. Uh, he's jumping on. I don't know who he's jumping on, but that person's almost dead. It's a hunter. Stop using your stupid traps, hunter. Just takes all my bleeds off. This dude would be dead by now. I swear, hunter using traps every five seconds. Uh, damage wise, in the middle. Healing wise, in the middle. Uh, what is that? Fifth on horde. Eighth overall. Or seventh overall. Whatever. Uh, here's the breakdown of my damage. Rip, of course, is top. Rake, Feral Frenzy Dot is third, which tells me that the bleeds were hitting really hard with Adaptive Swarm. Uh, and then just goes down on the breakdown, so you can see how each damage breaks down to my total percent and the crit and regular hit. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe, and thank you for watching. Take care.